In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a complete company profile presentation in PowerPoint. And I'm going to show you how you can design this slide very easily. So this is the very first slide, the title slide or the main slide where I put the, the image of the company here. You can add the title company profile and you can give the name of the presentation and below if you want to add some details and add the company website here. And in the second slide, I have created the table of content where I'm going to talk about about the company vision and mission, our team services and contact us. As you can see here, I've changed the image to show which is the inside of the company or you can just show any images as per your requirement. And here you can add some more details as well. And then the third slide, which I'm going to talk about is about company. Again, you can see here the image of the company, add some details here. Then the next slide I'm talking about our values where I'm going to talk about the mission and vision. And then comes our team where you can add the, uh, the, the staff details here or the higher management like CEO, CFO and all those things. Information here and you can add their name and some details about uh, each employee. And the next slide which I'm going to talk about the services we offer where you can define the services here. I've just put service one, service two, three, and four. And then the last slide where I've added the let's connect with us or the contact us where you can add the telephone number, the email ID, the address of that one and further details at the bottom. And in this particular tutorial, I'm going to show you these two slides, which I'm going to show you how to design this company profile as well as the table of contents. Please share, like and subscribe my channel and the only channel on YouTube for PowerPoint where you can get 1000 plus free templates absolutely free and I have provided the link on the video description section of each video and you can support my channel through PayPal or Patreon. So let's start the tutorial. So now I'm going to show you how to create the title slide or the main slide here for that first go to the insert tab shapes select the rectangle draw or rectangle covering this much area of the slide shape outline make it no outline and then I'm going to insert an image into this particular uh, rectangle for that you need to go to fill and select picture or texture fill by default this picture is showing because I have already used in my previous slides that's the reason otherwise it will show you a kind of a different pattern here okay not a problem so let me just change the image uh, to suit my requirement for that go to insert when you say insert, you can insert from a file, from the stock images, online pictures or from icons. So I'm going to choose the online pictures and here I'm going to say, for example, some office uh, images all right, or office buildings. So let me just search here, office buildings, all right. So you can see here I've got wide variety of buildings to choose from and here you can see here the creative commons. Uh, that means this you can use it without any problem but when you untick this one it may subject to copyright all right so you have to be very careful when using this particular uh, images anyway so just for the testing purpose i'm just going to select this one and click insert and you can see here the image got inserted here all right now to uh, make the slide more creative i'm going to add few more shapes and all those things so first of all go to insert shapes select the rectangle again and draw the rectangle from the corner maybe this much size shape outline make it no outline and depending on the requirement you can just choose any color to fill here so i'm going to choose some orange color it looks something like this all right and then i'm going to insert uh, one more rectangle to add the title for that go to insert shapes select the rectangle again draw the rectangle all right shape outline make it no outline and shape fill i'm going to select this white and i, I would like to add one more orange uh, rectangle here for that press ctrl d to duplicate shape fill i'm going to give orange color reduce the width and put it here all right so it looks something like this and then go to insert text box here i'm going to type company profile or any title of your choice 
and make sure to make it bold i'm going to use open sans extra bold and you can just make it a uh, kind of a loose and start increasing the size you can see here i'm going to make it 44 center align or you can just increase also maybe 48 let's see all right this is okay here so company profile and then i would like to add small title here about the company name and all those things or the presentation so i'm going to just type company profile presentation or you can add some company name as well here right align and i'm going to give a kind of gray color all right and reduce the font size to 14 and i'm going to put it here and if you want you can just add one icon or the company logo also here so instead of company logo i'm just going to add kind of a random icon here which represents for example company logo so click insert and i'm going to fill this color with the same color orange and i'm going to make the height and width as 0 0.6 a smaller one and i'm going to put it here all right it looks something like this and below i would like to add the company website so go to insert text box or i can just select this one hold the control shift key drag this down reduce the font size further maybe 14 and here www dot company name dot com all right and then if you like to add some detailed text here you can just add some detailed text equals lorem within brackets one and i don't need this much large text so i'm going to keep only this much again reduce the font size color right align and put it here all right so it looks something like this all right so this is my very first uh, slide uh, kind of a, a title slide you can say so this is how you can design and similarly you can just design a slide which looks something like this also again for that i'm going to add a new slide i'm going to delete this so here i'm going to add table of contents and you can see a different image here right so for that go to insert shapes select the rectangle draw the rectangle only this much size shape outline make it no outline then picture or texture fill you remember the same picture will be copied here okay now i'm going to change by clicking on the insert and i'm going to say online pictures and i'm going to type office here all right and you can see here i've got wide variety again if i untick this one it will give me more options to choose so i can just choose any of this let me just choose this one click insert and the image got inserted here and you can see here there's something the image is not uh, you know aligned properly in that particular box so for that what you can do is first of all untick this one and you can see this offset properties so i'm going to offset right you can see here and offset left all right so it looks much more professional now so once this is done i'm going to insert one rectangle here all right small rectangle just to give some aesthetics okay shape outline no outline shape fill i'm going to give the same color here all right and then i'm going to add table of contents so insert text box i'll just say table of content or contents or anything make the same open sans extra bold increase the size and make sure it comes on the two lines here all right i can make it more also more bigger and i'm going to keep it here so it looks something like this all right so table of contents here so then i'm going to add one more rectangle here press ctrl d to duplicate reduce the height increase the width okay and i'm going to add something like this here i can just reduce it okay and then go to the insert shapes 
from the basic shapes i'm going to choose the hexagon just click it here and i'm going to rotate by holding the alt and the right arrow key one two three four five six times we need to uh, click the right arrow key by holding the shift key and then i'm going to give this as some gray color make the height and width as maybe 0 0.7 and here also 0.8 all right looks like this shape outline make it no outline or i can reduce further and i'm just going to hold it like this and then the first table of content for example about company mission and vision our values all those things i'm going to type it here so let me just reduce the size further and if you want you can insert some icon here also okay for that go to insert icon and then you can just choose any relevant icon here okay for example let me just choose uh, icon which is uh, say this one click insert and reduce the size to 0.4 and i'm going to give the color as white and put it here on top of this like this so you can add any relevant icon also here okay so now once this is done i'm going to type the one which is about company so go to insert text box I'll just say about company you can make it bold or you can use the open sans instead of extra bold I'm going to use semi bold okay and then if you want you can keep font size as 18 then now I'm going to select all these three objects hold the control shift key so this is my second table of content my third fourth fifth okay depending on the requirement you can increase also so the next one is vision and mission our team so i'm just going to type vision and mission and then we have got uh, our team our services i'll just say our team our services and i'm saying that uh, contact us okay so you can see i've done this one now it's very easy for me vision and mission for example i'm just going to select this particular uh, icon go to the graphic format change graphics from icon and here i'm going to say for example i because vision and mission should be kind of an i i'm going to select this one and click insert and you can see here the icon got changed so here also you can just change for my team our services contact us all those icons can be changed and if you want to add few more details here so for example control d to duplicate this one i'm going to make it kind of more design effects here and then i'm going to add few more details so equals lorem within bracket one reduce the font size and put it here if you want you can just increase the font size and you can make it justify also and put it here so you can see here i have made the table of content and from here i can just copy this also so that every slide should be having this for example i'm going to put it here okay again it depends from where you want to put all right so similarly you can just create the way i just made the presentation uh, like these two slides the same third slide also you can make it okay and you can just give about company then mission and vision our team our services all those things the similar way uh, how i have designed just now you can just design it